Okay, I have a Lenovo 1577 tower, and it has this issue. I installed Windows 11 Home on it, and it loads right up, loads within just about 15 seconds or so. Um, four gigabytes of RAM, gets to the home screen in just a second. I don't have my Wi-Fi uh, antenna in there right now, so it won't connect to the net. But the issue that I've had, and I removed the original PSU from there, and I put in a temporary one from a uh, short form factor, small form factor computer. But it was doing this. I go to the start menu and I go to shut down. And I shut down. And you expect the fan to stop running at some point, but it just keeps going. Screen's powered off, no video signal, but the fan just keeps going. So the only way to turn this thing down completely is to, well, I could yank the power cord, but I won't do that. So I just power down with the start switch, start button, until it goes down. There we go, it's finally powered down. And I don't know why this happens. Uh, I figured that changing out the RAM would work. It didn't. I changed out the power supply. Still does the same thing, but the computer runs perfectly otherwise. It has a 120 gigabyte hard drive with a 250 storage drive, and the uh, Windows 11 is on this one, is on the SSD. And I have no idea why this happens. I've never heard about this thing happening before. Um, if any of you have had the same issue, um, do you just live with it by holding the power button down to turn it off, or um, do you pull it from the, you remove the power cord, or do you just allow the thing to just run? Um, I don't know, I don't need any fixes. Is this a BIOS issue? Do I need to download a um, a special utility from you know Windows Store or something? Uh, give me your ideas. Thanks.